Hello everyone, welcome back to Higher Mathematics. Today we have an interesting limit. What is the limit as x approaches to zero of the function sine 3x all over x? So what we're going to do in our case? We all know that right here we will have an undefined answer, we will have zero over zero, so we need to use a substitution right here. So we will have an interesting case. Let's use a substitution. So let's t equal to this 3x. And from here our x equal to dividing both sides by 3, we will have that our x equal to t over, over 3. And of course, from here, if x approaches to 0, our t approaches to 0 as well. So t goes to 0. So this is our substitution. So what we're going to do in our case? Let's use this substitution. We will have that this limit will be equal to limit, but not x, t right now, so t goes to 0. But in our case, instead of this 3x, we write t, so we will have sine, sine t. And in our denominator, instead of this x, we will have t over, t over 3. If we divide in this, this 3 goes to our denominator. And moreover, this is a constant, so we can write this 3 right here. So as a result, we will have that this will be equal to 3 times limit t approaches to 0 of the function sine t over t. And we all know this is the case that we need to learn, that we need to remember, that this one goes to 1. This is a perfect limit, so we need to know, we need to learn this limit as well. And the last step, we need to multiply this 3 by this 1, and we will have that our limit is equal to 3. And this is our answer, using a substitution right here, and we need to know about this limit. But, of course, we know about the classic case with x, but right here we have t, so it doesn't matter. We need to use this case with t. So our answer is 3. If you have any question, if you have any suggestion, maybe you have faster method how to solve it, write your suggestion in the comment, write your question in the comment. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next videos.